It's crisp. It's keto. It's keto crisp. And today, I'm gonna tell you what I think about these. Let's go. Hey guys, what's good? Joe here with Let's Go Low Carb. Thanks for tuning in and sharing your time with me. And today I wanna to get into this real quick, Keto Crisp. Now I gotta tell you, I saw these at Whole Foods. I picked them up, brought them home, didn't check them out for a while, so I'm about to check them out now. But in the meantime, I did watch a little video that was on their website, and I really wanna like these. I really, really wanna like these, um, just because of the story of the guy who invented them. Um, and I'm going to leave a link below so that you can check out uh, the story, you, you can check out their website. Uh, whether I like these, whether I personally like these or not, you should still check out the story because it's inspirational either way. So, um, but I'll share that with you guys. Um, so let's get into this Keto Crisp. This makes me, I'll tell you what it makes me think of. It makes me think of something that's like Rice Krispies or something with like Rice Krispies in it or something like that, but it's a keto version of something with something like Rice Krispies in it. So you got that. So I have almond butter and chocolate chip and I have chocolate mint. So I'm gonna check out the almond butter and chocolate chip first and I'm gonna let you know what I think. Looking at the ingredients on these, let's take a look here. Um, they have, I'm just gonna tell you about the sweeteners. Uh, they have erythritol, they have um, some stevia in it. So erythritol and stevia, no allulose, uh, no artificial sweeteners. So let's check these out. I've got the Keto Crisp Almond Butter Chocolate Chip, and I'll let you know what I think about this. Um, you open it up. It definitely looks like a protein bar. So it's not one of those one that like, it's like, hey, we're kind of like a candy bar. Or we're trying to do a candy bar thing. It definitely looks like a protein bar. So it's like, it looks like he's trying to do a protein bar. There are little pieces in there that do kind of look like Rice Krispies or something similar to that. So it's like their version of that. So I'm gonna take this little bite here and I'm gonna let you know what I think about this. Hmm. Exactly what I thought. It's kind of got that crunchy rice crispy or crispy rice flavor. Um, wow. So let's go back to this. It's got that protein bar type of look to it. This is sweet though. It's, it's a lot sweeter than a lot of protein bars. It's almost kind of like a candy bar, but not really. But man, this is really good. It's a, gotta be honest with you, I was expecting protein bar, not a lot of sweetness, but this is really good. And I was thinking almond butter. I don't like almonds, but this is like fantastic. I got a little bit of a, a little bit of an aftertaste to it, but it's so good, I might even deal with it. Wow, that's really good. Um, I didn't think I was gonna like it that much. I gotta be honest with you. I wanted to, but I didn't think I was going to. Um, really good, man. So let's check out the um, the total. I can't see it on this one, so we'll have to look at the other one. All right. So now let me check out the chocolate mint one, but I'm gonna take a little water first. There is a little bit of that aftertaste, that stevia aftertaste that you get on these, but it's fairly bearable. Um, it, I wish they would use allulose instead or uh, less stevia, more erythritol. This thing is chocolatey. So that's why it's called chocolate mint. The so chocolate mint and then you've got the little, uh, little crispies in there. So I'm gonna take a bite of this. I'm gonna let you know what I think about this. This looks like it's gonna be really good and I'm hoping it is. Man, both of these are better than I thought they were gonna be. Wow, they're really good. I mean, look, I don't know if these are considered protein bars or what they are, but there's like five net carbs in this one. Uh, there's also four net carbs in this one. Uh, maybe the extra carbs from the chocolate, I'm not sure. 
but these are really good. As far as um, everything else, I know that they, uh, most of it's like all natural stuff. You got whey protein concentrate, rice flour, coconut, erythritol. Um, there's a lot of different things in here, but definitely check these out. I would say on a one to 10, I would say that these for me are like a seven and a half to an eight because I wasn't expecting them to be this good. So if you like um, little snack bars to have handy and you want something um, that has like some sweetness to it and is good, um, actually better than I thought they were gonna be, definitely check these out. And then please go go to their website. I'm gonna, like I said, I'm gonna leave a link below so that you can go to their website and check out the um, inventor's story and how he came up with these. And uh, hopefully that'll inspire you to also do something as well, if that's something that you wanna do. So um, again, please like this channel, please subscribe to this channel, like the video down below, and share this video with your friends who are looking for something sweet, some kind of bar to keep handy. And I'll see you next time with some more Low Carb Lowdown.